Hey guys, this is Effective Kill here for Seven Days to Die. Uh, it's a new game that uh, has been funded by Kickstarter successfully. I'm gonna beat up these flowers because a little angry at my fucking recording equipment and the. Jeez. Get out of that. And if you hear that that yelling in the background, that's uh, that's probably a single zombie tracking me. See him? He's right there. That's uh, he, his name is Frank. He's kind of an idiot. He's been tracking me for a couple days, but he lost my scent because uh, he's a. Uh, Frank is not. Uh, Frank is not all there. Frank is a little. Um, he's he's not one of the smarter zombies. Uh, if you punch stuff, zombies will notice. Uh, this game is basically a combination of Minecraft and kind of Daisy with the survival aspect. You can notice in the left-hand corner, you see the little uh, endurance thing. Uh, you see my endurance, my health, my food, and my water. Uh, I'm gonna check this trash if I can because the, the box is very annoying where it is. Apparently, it's not. That's one thing I'd, I'd like them to fix, is I got food. I got some blueberries, so I I'm, I'm got some food. I want to check this place because there's got to be useful stuff in here. Uh, that looks like a tent, but there's some... Okay, looks like zombies may be either eat, killing the pig or screwing it. Um, either uh, thing uh, scares me to, uh, to no depth. Okay, so food. There we go. That was uh, that's ammunition. Okay, I don't know what those zombies are doing, but I'm gonna take this. Take that- ow! Fuck. Okay, I gotta lead these guys away, cause... Let's see if there's anything in here. Okay, it looks like it's just cloth. This is a cloth tent. Um, let me move. Thank you, game. Uh, there's more of those. I'll try to trick the zombies so I can quickly check that this area has anything useful. Okay, backpack, food, corpse, the useless piece of shit with a book on him, that's all. Ow. Please, game, let me move. Okay, I already have a knapsack, so I have my, uh, I'd like to get at that other stump that they're guarding. I think they're guarding. Nope, they're not guarding a stump, so there's nothing of use here. Um... They're gonna keep following me. Uh, till they either lose the scent or something else interests them. And nothing else interests them but the human. Because uh, apparently we're very tasty. And they, they like to find me. Let's see if I can lose them. Okay, that's the dynamic effect of when you start to punch stuff. Okay, I found my first weapon. Let's take my weapon. And I have a couple of shots. And it looks like I'm screwed here. Looks like I may be screwed, and I'm fucked. Looks like I got screwed there because the game decided to kill me. Anything on your, um, really, this, this game is annoying in the fact that it's loud. I've lowered the sound a bit, but the game is still surprisingly loud, and I've got to get that gun, because if I lose the gun, I won't have anything to defend me from Nightfall. Uh, the, the game is also annoying in one fact of, if you're stuck, you better not panic, because you're fucked if you see a couple of zombies around you. They are going to kill you. Uh, also, if the, the buildings are based around support, so if the supports are destroyed, uh, the building will fall. Like, you see, I still have the 9mm magazine as well as the 10mm on me. I really wish I could crouch, but apparently that setting got turned off. And, um, if I can just sneak around these guys and get at the tent from the back, maybe I can recover my lost items. Uh, because they are, uh, they are a hungry bunch. Okay, they saw me. Screw it. Destroying everything. Okay, looks like the gun got destroyed. Unfortunately. Let's take the cooking pot. Looks like the gun got destroyed, so I lost my weapon. That's fun. Take some cloth. Nothing in there. But really, the bad thing is, when searching stuff and getting out of the inventory, they, the zombies will get a free hit on you. And they're, they're painfully fast with how they hit you. See, I was better in my first game, because my first game, I had a rocket launcher. That was the first weapon I found, is I found a random rocket launcher in the middle of nowhere. 
that I can use, but here you're kind of screwed, um, specifically because my crouch button doesn't work. My crouch button was C, and it didn't work, so perhaps when I try this out again I'll be able to find it. Okay, I got some pills, I got some water, so let's put those down there. I got some food as well. Let's, uh, let's eat one of the pills. Let's click 8. Take the pill. So I'm back to I'm back to 10%. Um, obviously, with a town, is there's going to be a lot of zombies around it. But if I can try to get into a building without attracting a lot of attention, it should be good. But I'm probably already attracted some attention. So let's get inside the building. Let's close the building so they don't know I'm in here. Because the doors are a zombie's biggest enemy. Okay, let's get in the building. Let's close the door. Okay, let's stay on the ground floor and let's stay away from windows. Uh, cloth. Some pills and some shotgun shells. More water, more pills. An empty, an empty glass bottle that I can use to get more water. Okay, looks like I found a literal gold mine here. Um, they're already in here, so they're gonna run faster. I'm gonna wanna go upstairs and search up here. I can hear them running. They're they're, uh, they're gonna try to find me and eat me. Um, you can hear that. See, see, this is what I'm talking about. Zombies like to teleport up walls, and if they surround you, you're pretty much screwed unless you can figure out a quick way out. And as said before. They're f really, really painfully fucking loud. Really annoyingly loud. And the bad thing is, inside buildings, zombies get an advantage because it's dark. It's, it's really annoyingly bullshit. That they get an advantage of being able to run twice the speed. So, heck, that one cabin that I had was my best bet for finding something, and I can't even keep quiet is this, and I've just destroyed my food that I was trying to pick up, so that's fun. Um, see if I can try to lose them. Uh, looks like this was an apartment block. Small scale area. Um, let's take that. Okay, it looks like they're, they're either killing the pig or screwing it. I don't know which. I'd say either or could work. Um, there's nothing on the shelves. There's some wood that I can I can take some of this. I believe. Uh, yeah, I can take some wood. Chair. The chair gives you either plank wood or it will break apart and it will give you something more useful. Okay, they they're he they're hearing me breaking wood, so they're they're gonna get curious and they're gonna get angry and they're gonna start eating me. Now I have those pills to, to go back on if I if I get screwed. See they're hunting the pig. I can hear that. The door was open here, so there's a good chance they could figure out how to get in. And if I'm very, very lucky, which I hope I am. They won't be able to figure out I'm in here. Uh, okay, looks like I found something of use. What's, what's this? Found an old sawed-off pump shotgun. That should use my, uh, my stuff. So I, I have a weapon now. I have uh, something to keep me alive. I prefer not to have the shotgun because, uh, well, it's a shotgun and it's loud. And it attracts a lot of attention. Okay, it looks like I have a roof access that I could build. I, I could I could hide up out on the roof when nightfall happens. And I, I've gotten so far pretty lucky with what I've been able to find. Plenty of water. So I won't have to worry about going to a lake soon. Whatever this place was, it was well stocked with water. If it's a house, people really like the water. I could probably block off the lower entrance if I wanted. Um, mostly just the beginning is you're finding stuff. I found another pump action shotgun, so if I die, I'll start with a pump action shotgun on me. And oh my god, this place is a gold mine for weapons. Get some books. Uh, it's a nightstand. If I wanted to pick up a bed, I could have a bed. 
Though, I don't really see the use of a bed. You see, they're all down there, and they're all doing something. They're probably surrounding a dead pig. Uh, there's a cook pot up there. I think I have to make a fire if I want to cook something. Let's get to the roof. Okay, this game is really finicky with that. Is I'm at the roof now. Is there anyone up here? I cannot tell. Okay, I got lucky again. There are no zombies on the roof. Looks like people were trying to escape by the roof, and they, they pretty much failed. But their failure is my survival, so... Um, I guess I, I shouldn't feel too bad that they failed where I would survive. Um, I can't jump off the roof or it's probably an instant death. I don't know exactly. Really, I'm just trying to gather as much materials as I need. This, uh, as I said, this is very much like Minecraft, so it's very much with crafting. Like, uh, I could place a block right there and uh, prevent their... Like, uh, let's test that. I placed a block and uh, I placed two wooden boards. So that was useless. Can I get those back? I, it looks like I can't. Okay, uh... Okay, I have my shoddy. And with my shotgun, I have 16... 6 shells. Okay, I have a little sniper rifle that I'm gonna also keep in my inventory. Uh... See how many sh I have uh, five bullets with that. My shoddy, I also have five. Um, see if I can take some pot shots at some zombies and start to kill some of them all. Okay, that attracted them. I probably shouldn't have done this, but I can kill off a couple. And the big guys. Fuck. Looks like I'm out of ammo. Okay, I could probably... Okay, I don't have the length. Uh... Okay, let's go downstairs and try to get to another building. Because I've attracted them. And what that means is I'm going to get a lot of heat very quickly. I'm basically... Okay, they're starting to destroy my doors for some reason. I don't know why that one's doing that, but let's see if I can... Okay. Apparently it just wanted to destroy shit. I, I don't know why it did that. But let's, let's... I guess I can't reload with R, or I don't have enough bullets. Do I have enough bullets? 26. That was a cheerleader. Save the cheerleader! Save the world! I don't know what this thing is. It's a boiled walker? Bloated walker? Okay, um... Hmm. Hi, guys. You see, um... How do I reload? Let's just try that. Maybe that's how I reload. Okay, so I do need the bullets in my inventory to reload. Or in my current thing. Let's, uh... Okay, um, dude. So uh, let's clean out this town. Oh, these things are ugly. None of them probably have stuff on them. Looks like I have plenty of shells left. Hey, dude. Get the fuck out. Let's wipe out this town's infection. Because I'm pretty sure I have the ammunition to take this town down. See, this is what they like to do. They're not very bright. But they're fast. In the dark. See? You notice how quick he was compared to the other ones? In the dark, they get an advanced... Uh, they they get basically get some... Um, ooh, scrap metal. Hey, 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 hey. I should have let him destroy this stuff. Uh, really, I don't need the sleeping bag or the cooking pot but I am gonna move this upstairs
because I like this place. This is a good place to hide out, and if need be, I can hide out on the ceiling, and I can store stuff up here. I have a suitcase. I could put stuff in the suitcase. Put my extra shoddy in the suitcase, along with some ammunition that I don't have use yet. Uh, Carrier filter. I don't have the necessary things to make a bomb out of that. Um, potato seeds. Oh, ooh, seeds. Seeds. That is for farming. I'm going to put that in a separate place. Uh, okay, that's the suitcase right there. Uh, in the cardboard box, I'm going to put all my extra water as well as my extra pills. Here's, actually, I'm going to take a pill. I'm going to put this pill on that pill, and I get two pill. And I'm going to put my food in here as well. Okay, um, I guess, okay, that's five water. So I guess water and other materials stack up to five. So, um, let's put five there, and let's, uh, let's keep one water in my inventory. Let's put all my bottled water up here because uh, it would be more useful to keep these in boxes on my uh, my roof hideout. Let's, uh, let's put a bedroll here. Let's put that right there and bam! Bedroll. I don't know how to use it though. I, 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 whatever, I have a sleeping bag. And a uh, weathered uh, thing. I, I'm safe on my roof. My roof is safe. Uh, they, the only way for them to get up is that way. Uh, let's also store my sniper rifle uh, up here in this box. Wait, do I have three shotguns? I had three fucking shotguns. Heesh. Uh, let's just throw away my paper. Let's, uh, can I drop this somehow? Throw away the cloth. Okay, my paper and my cloth are on the ground. It's it's starting to get a little dark. So, um, how do I sleep? Is there a sleep command? S L. K I O P U Y H. Okay, let's uh, let's stay safe for the night. Is uh, I know they're coming, so let's. Uh, f there we go. Now they can't get in, or to get in they'd have to break that wood block, and I can't hear them anymore. Let's uh, let's also get a vantage point. Okay. Really wish I could crouch. Okay, there. There. There's Joe. See, see, Joe used to live in this town. He, he, um, um, he, he lived in that building, he, an apartment block with, uh, with two other families. It, it was kind of small. Joe, um, Joe, Joe was never a very bright man to begin with. He, he was a little stupid. He, he'd hit walls a lot. Um, he wasn't like mentally handicapped or anything. He was just plain stupid. And see, see, Joe, 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 don't run, don't jump, jump, Joe. You have so much to live for. Joe, here, here, Joe. I'll try to make it easier for you. There you go. I put Joe out of his uh, out of his misery. So let's uh. Unfortunately, that's a glitch with the shotgun. Is it reloads all of the shells that I have? So there we go. Um, I okay. One thing I wouldn't want to do is once I get enough wood, I'm gonna build uh kind of similar roads above this place to to uh, survive. One thing I think I could do is I could probably make this into farmland up here, and I'd be safe. I don't know how to sleep, though. That's very annoying that I can't click it to sleep it, and I don't want to destroy it. Maybe I need to actually go to a bed. Okay, there's my wood. The wood is bouncing. Let's get down here. It's, this is pretty much useless wood sitting right here. That's a plank. Let's get all the useful wood. Also, this game's uh, structural support. Structures rely on... Uh... Okay, I'm getting tired. But I can't quit yet. The wood hasn't broken yet. Okay, so... Okay, there's some useful wood. Um, I think I have some neighbors downstairs. Uh, let, let's go greet them with, uh, with Susan. Susan is the name of my shotgun. Susan the shotgun. She's a pretty gal. I think I could make a, a wooden door. Okay, I noticed they were quicker inside. These ones... 
learn so quick. They're, they're kind of slow. Interesting. Oh, go! Bacon! Free bacon! Fuck, I bucked up fucking today. Free bacon, free bacon, free bacon. Don't escape, little pig. You can't escape from me because I am God! Free bacon. Okay, we have neighbors. Get off my lawn. I think zombies will continue to spawn even if you clear out an area. But it makes me feel a little safer if I kill them all around my vicinity. Also, I need to make a door, so I need to gather more materials. Let's see what happens when I do that. Okay, this is a quick method, but it's kind of wasteful because I'm wasting bullets, but I need some doors. I could probably make a scrap door with the amount of scrap that I have, but nah, I'll figure it out. Let's, uh, let's go back upstairs and reload my shotgun. I could probably destroy the stairs as well, but I prefer to keep those up. So I'm down to 20 shells. Uh, wooden planks. Let's see what this does. So that is a wood pole segment. That's a wall. And that's a door. So you don't have to go look up ingredients uh, to make stuff. Uh, see, I can make a door right there, and I have a scrap metal door. This uh, this will protect me a little better, because I'm a little paranoid that they're gonna break out, break down my door down here. Cause I can hear that. Ah, ah, yeah. Get out of my house. Ah, damn it! Reload the shotgun, you stupid, you fucking idiot! You pick, you dropped your shotgun. Okay, emergency, emergency escape, emergency, dumbass. This guy's so stupid. Emergency escape, going to the top. I'm royally screwed. If, if they can't climb, that's good, but I think they can- Why do you keep dropping your shotgun? <laughs> There's the health indicator right there. Once it goes down, my shotgun will be pretty useless. I don't know what this is. Well, I kind of just wasted all my scrap metal, making pretty useless stuff. Can I make a trap door? Let's see if I can make an axe. Is that an axe? Tell me how to make... Oh, oh. Spike club. Um... I'm gonna guess it's this. There we go, I have a melee weapon of actual use. Okay, I don't know. I don't think they can figure out how to climb up, so I'm safe for now. 
I don't know if safe would be the best word to say my present situation. And it's not giving me the chance to sleep. So I can't just sleep through the night. That's um Do I need to unlock the ability to sleep? Ugh. Okay, looks like I'm starting to get hungry and thirsty. So let's um let's get my water up back up. Here's my door. That'd be pretty useless. Okay, I wish there was something to tell me, um... Tell me how to make an axe. This game's a bit confusing with recipes and such, so... Well, I think I'm gonna end it off here. Um, I don't know what to do next. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty well screwed on my roof. I, I have a club and a rock and, uh, and a shotgun. I have my little footstep that I can just go about the town, but... I think I should have never taken a pot shot there. Um... They can probably figure out how to get up here, so I'm probably screwed. They're probably just destroying stuff to get up to me, so... Um, until next time, wish me luck on surviving, or I'll die myself.